Who has the right to say that the performing arts subjects are less important than others? Music isn't a real GCSE and it doesn't lead to a proper job. How many times have you heard, thought or even said this? Personally, I heard this too many times, especially a couple of years ago when choosing my GCSE options. In year eight, I chose music, art, performing arts and computer science. And instantly everyone around me was telling me how great computer science was and how I should go down that route. Well, that's great, but what about the others? It made me start questioning myself of, is my dream job actually just stupid and should I give up? It wasn't until the September of that year nine when I got into that class and I realised that my class mostly consisted of people that didn't want to be there and took music and drama as an easy GCSE. Well, I ask you, how many of you in here can actually play an instrument? How many of you in here, if I gave you a blank piece of paper and a pencil, could draw something amazing? And how many of you here would have the confidence to come and stand on this very stage and perform something? It isn't easy. I'm not very good at science. And so in my science class, I get five hours a week to sit there and learn. Well, <laughs> we get 50% less time of that focusing on subjects like music and the performing arts. I get two hours a week. And what is that school trying to tell us? We don't have enough time to do the things we want to do in comparison to the more academic subjects. My younger sister is in year nine, and when it came for her year group to choose their options, music, art and drama were all in the same block, forcing her year group to choose between the three. But subjects such as French, history and geography were in multiple blocks. They could choose between them, but not more creative subjects. Again, school reinforcing these ideas that more academic subjects should be focused on. Let's just focus and take a minute to think of how many times a day you listen to music. Whether it be today your YouTube and your new favourite song, or listening to the radio on your way here, or even the music leading me up to this very stage tonight. Everybody hears music and we take it for granted. But imagine the children, if we're not getting taught, there's going to be a gap in society of a silence. The, under more under, the more underprivileged children in this world, not only in Edlington, Doncaster or South Yorkshire, but up and down the country, don't have the opportunities to go to the theatre or a concert or an art gallery. You're taking this away from them. So I ask you, who has the right to tell an individual that the creative arts subjects are less important than others? Thank you.